Howdy, and welcome to the Bob and Brent Show. I'm Bob. And I'm Brent. On today's show, we're going to be talking about the limits of free speech. Brent, what are these limits of free speech? You see, Bob, there, there's six types. There's obscenity, defamation, fighting words, hate speech, speech that incites illegal action, and speech in schools. Hmm. Um, let's start out with defamation. Well, defamation, Bob, it's, it's speech that it's written or it's spoken out loud with words. But it's, it defames someone's character, it hurts them, puts them down. So, in other words, it hurts their reputation. Right, right. Um, defamation is actually a very slippery slope because one could argue that they have the uh, freedom of speech and freedom of press, but ultimately the uh, Supreme Court has the final decision. Mm -hmm. let, let, why don't we take a look at defamation? Let, let's roll the first clip. Yeah, this will teach on how to give me a bad grade in this class. What'd you put in there? I said he likes to uh, soak his feet in a bathtub of mayonnaise and pickle spears. <laughs> well, dude, you can't do that. That's defamation. We can get some serious trouble for that. Oh, those kids got on could have gotten into some really big trouble. Yeah. All right, let's take let's let's talk about hate speech now. What is hate speech? Well, hate, hate speech is just derogatory, negative remarks based on one's sexual orientation, race, religion, or gender. See what I did there? Oh, gender. <laughs> yeah, clever. Let's roll our next clip. Honey, you want some coffee? No, I got a cola. Okay, well, I'm gonna make me a cup. Hey, keep it down in there! I'm watching football! Shut the hell up, Roy! I'm trying to do the housework. Maybe we should get off your. <laughs> Out here. Oh, come on, Maria, you know you love me. Our love is what keeps us together. How can I love a lazy piece of trash like you? I'm leaving. Oh, come on, baby. Don't be so hateful. Well, a couple may need to see a marriage counselor. My wife and I went to see a marriage counselor once. And? That, that's it. Neat. Our next scene is going to be about obscenity. Obscenity is defined by the Supreme Court as speech or uh, action that portrays sex or nudity in a manner contrary to societal standards of decency. The Miller versus California Supreme Court case is set a precedent and it establishes the Miller test for obscenity to see if something is obscene or not. Hmm. Let's roll our next clip. Aw oh, yeah. We're getting some great footage. This is great stuff. Just keep going. Aw oh, yeah. Oh, Are we on? <clears throat> wow, that was kind of gross. Pretty good. No, you look pretty good. <laughs> Moving on. So, oh, sorry, sorry. Next clip involves fighting words. What are fighting words, Brent? Pretty self-explanatory, Bob. Good point. Let's roll the next clip. Jerry? Jerry? Mm. Alright, who gave Jerry the sleeping pills again? And Japan. Bernie. Bernie? Access powers. That is correct. That bull! Your girlfriend is a better basketball player than you! Well, you're being a third grader. Alright, I can't do this. There, nowhere in the script does it say this. I, you I can't start work with <laughs> Close to blowing up. Our next category is speech in schools. In a public school system, there are certain things you cannot say if it's distracting. Let's roll the next clip. Mr. Unreal. Yes? I'd like to let you know that you're the worst teacher of all time, and need to use Bosley hair regeneration cream. You're being really disrespectful. Thought he had it right. Next and last is speech that incites illegal action. In this next clip, look how the ringleader of the bullies tells his bully buddies to go pick on his poor, harmless, handsome young man. Let's roll the next clip. That's what you get. Sorry, I had to use the restroom. Really? You couldn't wait until the end of our show? I had to go. Well, we're on right now. Right now? Mm hmm. Sad to see stuff like that happening in our public school systems today. Well, times change. That they do. That they do. That pretty much wraps it up here for us at the Bob and Brent Show. I'm Bob. And I'm Brent. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. And remember, don't eat lunch at McDonald's. 
Because their food sucks, and it'll make you fat. Put that coffee away. Yeah.